Hello, hello, and welcome to another weekly grocery haul. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. My name is Kim and I'm on the WW Blue Plan. I have followed Weight Watchers as part of my journey to lose 100 pounds and keep it up. So in today's grocery haul, we're gonna do it in a couple bits and pieces. I just got back from my Kroger click list pickup and Kroger is where I do most of my weekly grocery shopping. We are also planning to hit up Sam's Club and then just me being a hot mess, I realized on my way to Kroger that I forgot to take my lunch bag in, which means I left a couple of my like staple items in the car that needed to be refrigerated. So we are going to have to replace a couple of things. If this is your jam to like this video, subscribe to my channel, turn on your notifications. I am so close to 1000 subscribers, which is just mind blowing. And so I am so grateful for your support and look forward to making many more videos. <laughs> Panera they I put like cream and look at that look at that so I just did the plain iced coffee I'm not gonna count the cream probably and then I put just a little of my own skinny syrup once I got here uh, I have the Panera coffee subscription so you get one coffee free every day I think you can actually go multiple times a day with the set like time period so it's a little dangerous but it's right next to my Kroger Let's get started. So first up we have just some Baby Bella sliced mushrooms. I love these with just a good veggie stir fry, put them in my eggs, do whatever. I ran out of baby carrots, <laughs> I know a shocker. I take these to work. These I find I snack on when I'm not hungry or just need to like bridge the gap, but love a good, actually, I put up with a good baby carrot. Let's put it that way. I also have a sweet potato here. I have several things that will go with this. I will be making a shredded barbecue chicken bowl, which will have roasted sweet potatoes, some slaw, and then obviously chicken. So the sweet potato will go with that. I think this is it for the produce because I just realized I forgot banana. So I will be definitely picking those up in my trip later today but I have some zucchini. I love roasted zucchini. You can also shred it and put it with rice, make a zucchini muffin, do whatever you do, but it's just another little fresh veggie option to have on hand. Next up, canned goods. I have some canned tuna here. It makes a great lunch tuna salad. I also picked up a couple cans of the Progresso Light Chicken Noodle Soup. One point per cup or two points on the WW Blue Plan for the entire can. These are just a really great lunch item that I like to have on hand, as you know. I have investigated some of the frozen meal options just for something quick if I don't have the time or don't want to make the time for meal prep, but I just feel like those are so many points for what you get, and I'd have to be bulking these up. And if you did not catch my meal prep video where I added chickpeas and chicken to a can of chicken noodle soup to bulk it up, Definitely check that out, but that is just something really great to have on hand. I did pick up a flat iron steak, which I just love. I love a good steak, and I do try to make sure that I am eating red meat. I know that some people avoid red meat, but I'm, I am anemic, and I should be taking iron supplements, but I get really bad. I just, and sometimes you get tired of chicken. Am I the only one? I know chicken zero points, and like, that's great, but well, zero points on the blue plan, sorry, green plan. But I just get tired of chicken. And so planning one night where I'm eating a good steak or a hamburger, just, and making, oh, I just, yeah. I just told you that I'm tired of eating chicken and I bought four packs of chicken breast. These were buy one, get one free this week. So I just stocked up and I do have, I think at least two meals, as I've said, on my meal plan last week that include chicken. So that everything chicken bites, and then the barbecue shredded chicken bowls. When I see this kind of sale, I just kind of go with it and stock up. I also picked up a package of center cut bacon. You know, I love this. Two slices for one point. You just can't beat it. 
I picked up the Thomas Light Multigrain English Muffins, three points on the WW Blue Plan, and I think all plans. Those are just delicious for a little exami. And then bagels for my husband, because I'm being nice. I also saw these for the kids, Reese Puffs treats. I think I was just intrigued by a lot of the coupons the Kroger had on its app. And then I picked up a value size box of the Fiber One Cinnamon Coffee Cake. I love these. These are a great alternative if you want a donut or a high point muffin in the morning if you're stopping through the Starbucks drive through And I find if I have these to take to work with me or just have on the weekends, then I'm less likely to kind of crave that bakery treat from a coffee shop. Of course, I picked up my low calorie reduced fat, whatever you want to call it, Swiss Miss, one point per packet. This is usually my after dinner treat when I want something sweet, but I'm not really hungry or I know that I'm going to want a treat later on in the evening. Kroger had, if you bought four bags of certain sacks, they were $1.99. So I did it. I got two bags for the kids because I'm super nice. That's a lie. I've been real grumpy lately, but we won't talk about it. Anyway. Simply Cheetos Puffs. I have not had these and they are 160 calories for 32 pieces. I'll throw the points up on the screen, but because you can kind of portion these out, you could probably do a good half portion for two points, which I think would be amazing. And then I also got the Poppables Sea Salt and I got these a few weeks ago and these are so good. And you can do, I think 15 for two points. And again, just a little light something. It says 28 pieces for 140 calories. And I think it's five points. We have some dairy items here. I picked up a, just a handful of Greek yogurt. So this is the Oikos triple zero banana cream. And this is two points on the WW Blue Plan. And what I love about this is this has 15 grams of protein. I also picked up the Oikos triple zero in the peach flavor. This is also 15 grams of protein. And then I have the light and fit Greek yogurt, two points on the WW Blue Plan. And this is toasted marshmallow. And let me tell you, it tastes like toasted marshmallow. I have some one third less fat cream cheese. I have an everything chicken dinner on the menu plan and it comes with, it comes with, you make the recipe and it magically comes down. No. And the recipe includes a, a cream cheese style dip. So I bought two of these. These are always great to have on hand. And who can say no to everything chicken? Like with the everything bagel seasoning, it's going to be amazing. I picked up some gum. This is another kind of thing where I know if I'm feeling snacky at work. And I really have been struggling since I've been back in the office full time with feeling like I just am eating out of boredom or I don't know what to do. Not that I'm bored at work. I have work to do. That's why I'm there but I'm just not used to just sitting. And so having gum to chew to change that flavor, just give me like something to do is really helpful. I needed to pick up some pantry items. So cling wrap and these snack size zipper bags. I feel bad because environmentally they are not great, but it makes it easy to, to prep all my carrots and put them in the fridge. That way I can just grab a bag and go in the morning when I'm throwing everything in my lunch bag. One new thing I also got this week are the Special K Pastry Crisps. I have had these before and I like to keep these in my snack drawer at work, keep the hunger at bay. But when I was looking, I've had the strawberry and I think I've had the other flavors years ago, but they had to me a new flavor and it says new right here, caramel latte. So I can drink this. Where's my iced coffee? My iced coffee and just be super caffeinated because apparently these have caffeine equal to half a cup of coffee. Now, I drink enough caffeine that I really don't need caffeine in my food, but I'm very intrigued by this flavor, so hopefully it's delicious. So apparently I bought all the rice at Kroger. Actually, they had the minute rice on sale with a coupon. So typically this can be like three bucks, but with the coupon it was $1.49 and I love a good deal. So I was a little disappointed. This, I was excited to get the cilantro and lime jasmine rice. But this is not really a single portion. It says it is. But this one container is 370 calories and it is 200 grams, whereas these packages are 125 grams. So really that is kind of close to two portions. Just quick lunch, quick dinner, whatever. So jasmine rice, love jasmine rice. I don't like plain white rice. And then 
I also got the brown and wild rice. I have not tried this yet, but I'm excited. For my barbecue shredded chicken bowls, I needed barbecue sauce, duh. And shopping online made this a little interesting, but with barbecue sauce, your main ingredients are typically sugar, ketchup, vinegar, and a lot of the cheaper options have high fructose corn syrup, so it can be really tricky when you're looking for a point-friendly barbecue sauce. So I did find this one. It is True Made Foods Pitmaster Barbecue Sauce, Carolina Red, and it said made with tomatoes, vinegar, and red pepper, no sugar added ever. So I know I did pay a premium for this, and sometimes you just gotta do what you do. And it is two tablespoons for 15 calories and obviously no protein. <laughs> I don't know why that made me laugh. And super good ingredients. Full cider, vinegar, tomato, puree, apple, butternut squash, carrots, mustard, black pepper, salt, red pepper, garlic powder, onions powder, paprika, and sage. I've not tried this before. Total like hope and a prayer, wing and a prayer, whatever you wanna say, just say a prayer. But I'm hopeful it's good. And what I like about this is it doesn't feel super fake. Just lots of good ingredients and it's getting the sweetness probably from the apple and the butternut squash. I also picked up a can of fat-free ready whip because I did. I finally bit the bullet and I'm going to try the Chobani coffee creamer with sweet cream. When I am drinking hot coffee, I drink it straight up. I like my coffee black, strong, but at work, I let my coffee kind of cool and then I'll drink it over ice. And this is 30 calories per. I also picked up a bag of the Tillamook shredded cheddar cheese. My husband loves shredded cheese on his eggs. That is a dog tail right there. I love the Tillamook, it's just such good quality. And so if you're gonna splurge on cheese, this is the one to do it. I also picked up a bag of broccoli slaw. This will go with those shredded barbecue bowls. And you could get regular coleslaw melts, but I like the broccoli slaw. I feel like it's just a little crunchier, a little different taste. I also had to refresh some staples, some soy sauce here. I got the less sodium soy sauce from Kikamon and then minced garlic. I just, I don't wanna chop my own garlic, I don't. I have an 18 count egg here, zero points on the WW Blue plan, but okay, that's it for the Kroger mostly, unless you wanna see the gallons of like white milk and chocolate milk that I bought for the kids, but I'm guessing you know what milk looks like. So we will continue this video on with Sam's Club and some other odds and ends. All right, it is time for part two of our grocery haul. It is not like insane. So my husband went to Sam's Club and we needed some like big stuff that I'm not gonna physically hold. We needed dog food. We needed alcoholic beverages. What else did he get? Oh, dish soap and then our laundry detergent. and. Just if you're looking for a good laundry detergent, we use the Tide Sport because between having little boys who are just kind of grubby and then, oh look, um, we like it because it gets my running clothes like defunctifies it all. It just smells so good. We love it, love it. And then he was also really kind. I just feel so cliche. <laughs> I got the Premier Protein Caramel so I am out of like my protein bars and we thought maybe I would try this with some coffee and just drink that at work. It is two points on the WW plans and 30 grams of protein, which is more than like anything I'm getting in a protein bar, which is amazing. So miracle of all miracles, we went to Target and I was putting our stuff in the back of the car and I found the bananas. I did not forget them at Kroger. They were just in the back and bonus, my husband was gonna pick them up at Sam's Club and he forgot, which is totally cool because he had so much on the list. Like we try to always spend around a hundred at Sam's and it was closer to two. And then also a Target, most exciting purchase of the day, reduced fat mayonnaise. I had left my mayonnaise in the car. I had taken it to work for I made a wrap with the blackened chicken, Tyson blackened chicken, zero points and a lay wrap, some cheese. And I didn't take my lunch bag in because it was Friday. I was like, what else? I'm just gonna be lazy. And well, that's what that got me. It got me a new thing of mayonnaise. While I was at Target, this isn't really grocery haul, but I picked up two skillets, the Faberware Reliance Pro Copper Ceramic Twin Pack. I love to cook in cast iron because it does help with my iron. 
and I just like the flavor. It's really great. But my oldest son has started making omelets and I'm not going to discourage that behavior if he's going to make me one. So I thought these would be better and they were, I think, $29.99 for the two of them. We picked up some whole floats. Now you're thinking, Kim, it is April and I thought you lived in Indiana. And it is April. I do live in Indiana. But we have an exciting delivery coming in just a couple weeks and we will be using those. So we are doing a lot of work in our backyard and I'm hoping we're gonna be posting a video, but just as we are getting everything ready, another part, an Amazon box came. And I had picked up some outdoor string lights um, that we will put on our covered patio. So I purchased these on Amazon OVS. And these are shatterproof. I'm hoping that they will look nice. Add a little ambiance as we relax in the evening. All right, so that is it for our WW Grocery Haul. I would love to know what new things that you have found at the store recently. I'm always looking for new foods that are tasty and gonna help me stay on track on the WW Blue Plan. And if you are not already subscribed, I would love it if you subscribe to my channel, like this video, turn on your notifications. And until next time, do something you love.